the latest now on that deadly rampage in Michigan. We're learning what Jason Dalton was like in the days before he killed six people, wounded two others, from the attorney for his family who's speaking out for the first time. ABC's Alex Perez has that exclusive interview. This morning, the attorney for Uber driver Jason Dalton's wife and parents is speaking out exclusively to ABC News. What's important to them is remembering the people who were hurt. The attorney revealing new details about Dalton's behavior in the days leading up to the shooting rampage that took the lives of six people. He's been acting different in the last couple days. Uh, and his wife asked him and he said he was tired. What made her think he was acting differently? Just his demeanor, that he seemed to be depressed and down, which was not his normal character. The married father of two, who only began driving for Uber in the weeks leading up to the shooting, now facing six counts of murder. When they saw him in court, what were they thinking? They're thinking, like everybody else, why? The motive, for now, remaining a mystery to even his family. Jason, by all accounts, was a fairly gregarious character, a good father, uh, well-known in the community, well-liked, uh, and there was nothing to indicate that something like this would occur. As new details reveal that Dalton went to his parents' house after the first shooting occurred at this residential complex, telling his family that his Chevy Equinox had been sideswiped and he needed to switch cars, eventually taking his parents' Chevy HHR before heading back out. And then a few hours after that's when police arrived. That's correct. Police told Carol what, what had happened. I know you weren't there, but that moment, was she in disbelief? I can only imagine. We haven't discussed that, but she's still in disbelief. For Good Morning America, Alex Perez, ABC News, Kalamazoo, Michigan.